is the experiment. <laughs> Griffin, we're back. Episode we're back. two of uh, reacting to bullshit. To bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I can't believe we made it this far, man. It's crazy. I can't believe I made it this far in general. <laughs> um, all right, let's jump into it. So when you would play the keys, hammers strike through the hole here. No way. Like where the bridge would normally be. You can, oh, no way. What? That's insane. Right? Wait, that, and that's not like a new video. So that's an old instrument. So for those of you who have no idea what just happened, a guitar normally has the the sound hole, and then it has a bridge, which pushes, it's pretty much putting pressure so the strings are sitting on top of it. But rather than a bridge, it, the, it's an acoustic, so it's going all the way to the back, and there's little mallets coming up and little keys on the inside, so you can play it like a piano, but you're still playing your chords with your left hand or your right hand, depending on what side you play with. That is insane. As someone who struggles with like finger picking, I could see that being super helpful. And the sound is, I mean, it's like, how else are you gonna get that like plucky hammer on sort of feel coming from under, that's, that's fucking genius. That's genius, yes. Yes, I would love one for my birthday. Thank you, Griffin. <laughs> I'll write that down. <laughs> now right, let's see the next one. A drummer, I'm always down with a drummer. No way. <laughs> I have to rewatch that one sec. Wait, so he was. Yeah, I'm not quite sure how it works either. Pretty memorized. Like mesmerizing. Though. I've never seen somebody do that in my 25 years of drumming. <laughs> and you know that dude did 300 takes to get that to work. I mean, the, the way that he flipped the stick at the beginning and then just put it right on without it, like jiggling around that was that was insane props to that dude um all right the next one we got a clavinet with the whammy bar on top which is the only way to use a clav <laughs> what that is nasty. That is nasty. <laughs> God, that is so cool. That that just puts every guitar player to shame real quick. If you're a guitar player and you think you're good, go pick up a clavinet with a whammy bar on it. Then talk to me. <laughs> Let's see what else we got. Oh, the feet too? Coconut looking thing. What? No way. Some people are too good for their, for, I don't even know what the right saying is, for their own good. Mm. Uh, that is, that is just insane. I have a tough time playing any of those instruments on their own, <laughs> let alone whistling or singing. Some people are just insane. And that's the kind of person who, who just sits at home and thinks of the craziest shit in the world. Mm. Props to that dude. That's, that's just wild. And he had the feet going. He had the little fucking 
coconut with the hole in it making this sound. He had the little drum, two little drums. Good for that, dude. We need him on the podcast. <laughs> Let's see what else we got. What? I spoke too soon. <laughs> yeah, you thought that last guy was impressive. <laughs> if you watched our last reaction video, I'm pretty sure this is the guy who was playing the, uh, <laughs> the, the butt horn. <laughs> the butt horn. Oh, and he's doing the, the bass notes with his feet like an organ. He's got different levers and pulleys and... Oh, he's got keys above his keys, too. What? <laughs> what? That is one of the craziest instruments I've ever... Or, or combination of instruments I've ever seen in my life. I People are just ridiculous. That could have been music's peak right there. I like, think that was music. Everybody who thinks that you're important now, you're wrong. <laughs> that was fucking crazy. Ooh, we got a har What is this called? A har harpeggi? Har harpsichord? Har harpeggichord? I've seen... Uh, I've seen... Oh, shoot, I'm blanking on his name. I've seen a bunch of artists play this, and it's just the most unbelievable instrument in the world. I looked them up, and they're so expensive. <laughs> I bet. Arpeggi. It doesn't look like he's pressing that hard. How is he doing that? That is nasty. That is nasty. God, people are so sick. Who would have thought that you can come up with a new instrument, too, that is so fucking useful and badass? I mean, that guy was just playing what would be like a guitar part on a mixture of a guitar and a piano, playing also the bass line on what would probably be like bass thickness strings. So you're getting that low end. That is, that is nasty. The that dexterity nasty. you have to have. Like, oh yeah, my fingers can't open up like that. <laughs> I mean, if that, if that guy and the, the dude before him meet up together, mm. game over. Game Yo, over. Imagine all three of them together, bro. That'd be, ins that'd be too much going on. That's a fucking orchestra. I think the, yeah, that's bigger than the Beatles right there. <laughs> For real. Yeah, uh, Paul McCartney, I think you need to get one of those and he's step your game up, big he's guy. He's shaking right now. <laughs> yeah, for real. <laughs> what is going on? It's very spooky like this. Yeah, it does. What did I just watch? What is that thing? <laughs> I forgot what it's called. I think it's called a like a water harp or something like that. So that is water inside of it? Yeah, so they put water in the top of it and then yeah, I guess like the vibration of the metal tubes with the water like reacting with the water inside. So it's kind of like a... when you play on like little um glass or or crystal um glasses and you put your finger around it. It's like sort of that vibe, but different size whatever uh, uh, metal tubes that you're what just happened I need to rewatch that real quick <laughs> oh and you can hear as he's moving it you could that's where that that like shallow um, movement is coming from inside because the water's moving around that is ridiculous right apparently it's called the water phone and yeah, it was used to make a bunch of like horror sound effects in movies back in the day. Well, if this was about interesting instruments, I don't think there could have been any more interesting instruments than this. This was I'm gonna I'm gonna go to bed thinking, that's for sure. That is ridiculous.
Thank you guys for hanging out for reaction video number two, brought to you by the one and only Griffin Siegel. Um, we'll see you next time. Love you.